Welcome to Tesla Giga Series, where we talk about the latest news and exciting development within the Tesla Giga factories. Please subscribe, like, and share our videos. It shows your appreciation for the work we put in here and motivates us to make more videos. Today, we'll be talking about the recent development as well as what makes news at Giga Berlin, Giga Shanghai, and Giga Russia. As the third quarter comes to a close, Tesla China has practically entered plaid mode with its operations in Gigafactory Shanghai. Based on recently taken videos of the expansive electric vehicle production plant, it appears that solid efforts are now underway to ensure that Giga Shanghai produces and delivers as many vehicles as possible until the end of the month. Aerial footage from the Wuwa channel on YouTube shows that Giga Shanghai is now a hub of activity. Large numbers of Model 3 and Model Y are transported to the facilities holding lots from the factory itself. Giga Shanghai staff who were transporting vehicles to the holding lots could even be seen stretching their legs as they continued their shifts. Gigafactory Shanghai's production and deliveries this September would likely be focused on the local Chinese market. With Giga Shanghai now serving as the company's primary vehicle export hub, Tesla China has been spending the first months of a quarter producing and transporting vehicles to other territories. The latter half of the quarter is generally allotted for the local market. With this in mind, there is a good chance that Tesla China's local figures for September would be quite impressive. Even with the company allotting the lion's share of its production and deliveries to foreign territories in July and August, after all, the Tesla Model 3 and Model Y still sold very well in China. It will then be unsurprising if the Model 3 or Model Y end up becoming one of China's best-selling EVs for September. Back in August, reports emerged stating that Gigafactory Shanghai has managed to achieve a production rate of 1,000 Model Y units per day, formally exceeding the facility's Model 3 daily output of 800 units. This improvement was achieved after Tesla China temporarily paused Model Y production in Gigafactory Shanghai to make way for upgrades on the facility's assembly lines. Gigafactory Shanghai is playing a more significant part in the company's operations. Wall Street consensus currently predicts that Tesla would deliver 221,000 vehicles in the third quarter, about half of which would be coming from the China-based factory. Tesla bulls such as at T. Roy Teslike, on the other hand, estimate that the company could report as many as 229,000 vehicle deliveries for the third quarter, over 120,000 of which would likely be from China. Meanwhile, Tesla opens pre-registration for GigaFest at Giga Berlin, an event on October 9 H that will allow citizens of Berlin and Brandenburg to join the automaker for a county fair. Tesla opens the doors of its Gigafactory in Grunheide on October 9, 2021, and invites citizens of Berlin and Brandenburg to a county fair. Join us to experience the most advanced electric vehicle production plant in the world. You'll have the opportunity to see behind the scenes during a factory tour, visit on-site booths, join various activities and ride along in Model Y, our newest electric car to arrive in Europe. Local food trucks will provide catering during the event, the company wrote on its website with the pre-registration form provided. The event has seemingly been approved ahead of the initial production phases at the factory. Tesla is set to launch production of its electric vehicles at the plant later this year after just 21 months of work at the site. Work is still not completed, and it will not be a finished facility even when Tesla starts production at the factory. The company is planning to add a battery factory to the facility in the coming years. For now, Tesla will send battery cells from Fremont, California, to the factory to complete the assembly of a vehicle. Tesla will start production at the factory with the Model Y which has recently become a hit in Europe after the automaker began exporting units from China to the region. As production nears for the Model Y in Germany, the vehicle will likely overtake its rivals in the sector. On the other hand, Tesla CEO Elon Musk has denied that the electric automaker has landed on a location for its fourth Gigafactory after reports indicated that Russia would be the location. Russian media outlets had indicated that the country's officials confirmed Tesla would build its newest production facility in Russia. The report comes from a website called Argumenti, and states in quotes. In principle, the decision on the plant in Korolyov was made in the Kremlin, said our source at the RF Chamber of Commerce and Industry. It's symbolic. After all, the founder of Tesla is known for his love for Russian astronautics and its history. 
He repeatedly mentioned the name of Sergei Pavlovich Korolyov in his interviews and books. Musk always said that the achievements of Roscosmos would not have been so powerful if the corporation had not stood on the shoulders of titans, among whom he includes Sergei Korolyov. One of the halls of the SpaceX Corporation bears his name. Additionally, the report indicates a source in the Ministry of Industry and Trade stated the advantages of the city of Korolyov have to do with historically concentrated highly qualified personnel who can start working in high tech production without high financial and time costs for retraining. While there were rumors of a Russian gigafactory earlier this year, Musk has now confirmed that Tesla has not landed on an official location for its next factory. The most likely location as of now for Tesla's next factory is probably India, where the automaker is currently testing vehicles for import. However, Musk said that Tesla would not build a factory in India until it tests demand through imports. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you in the next video. In the meantime, if you want to see more about the innovations Tesla is putting in place to make the world a better place, please subscribe to the channel.